In our prayer, we go pray. Send me this bus. May carry us safely reach our destination. Hello, everyone. Welcome to yet another time with me. It's been a long time, yeah. Thank you so much for joining me today. My name is Tatia Wabara. Yeah, let's just do this. Today we'll be reviewing. Oh, compliments of this season. Okay. Um, I don't know when you'll be watching this. So if it's in the new year, happy new year. And if what uh, if it's <laughs> before it before the new year, hi. Thank you so much for being with me till the end of 2022. I'm so glad we have to do this and we've got to do this. I'm so sorry I've been away. So today we'll be reviewing um, a Nigerian movie titled Solo Ye. Solo Ye. Sole. Okay, sorry. Sole. Okay, it's um, another one from Coyote Kashem with notable actors and actresses like... Um, Sola Sobo Wale, Aduni Ade, Femi Jacobs, Ade Jimeji, Latif, Meg Otanwa, Kelechi Udegbe, lots of actors, you know, popular actors and actresses featured in this movie that chronicled, you know, a travel from Lagos to the East. Now, you know how it is, you know, when you don't have money to pay, when you don't have good money to pay for all this, you know, Siena type um, of transportation you tend to go in or luxury buses you tend to use all this you know along the way transport to get to where you are or you know if you are not if you know if you don't get to the park and you're standing on the road and you want to get to you know the east or anywhere you're going to from lagos of course you would have to be flagging down all this transport now, it showed different people coming into this bus. The driver, you know, wanted to just use the bus, this new bus, for quick... Then they told him to drive it down to Inugo or something. So he wanted to just make quick money and then he entered and carried... It was carrying passengers. Now, Adonia Day was a sister with financial needs for the children at the motherless home um, where she was. And um, that was why she actually joined the trans, the the, the solely, you know, um, transport because she didn't have enough money. Megotanwa, you know, entered from the, you know, she didn't enter from the park. She had bought her wares for selling and was going back. You know, different people had this couple. We had Sola Sobowale, who was dressed in all this, you know. Um, modern Sunday like kind of you know wear and uh, we had different people we had um this um youths and all the young people that were you know saying that they were from the campus and all that now I would not say the whole um you know tell the story I'm trying to change my narrative a bit I will not be telling you the whole story but I'm sure a lot of us have been able to see this so late it's been months, you know, um, several weeks, this movie um, started showing on Netflix. And I'm sure before now, a lot of people have seen it. So um, let's just go into what we actually think about this movie. Now, Sole, um, what, what, what impressed me was the storyline. The storyline was different and fresh. The storyline was wonderful because... Everything was done inside of the bus. Um, most of everything that happened was real. You know, the way you will see people marketing their wares or pastor inside praying, collecting, um, you know, offering and all of that. You will see them all in this movie, inside the bus. The videography, the way... The cinematography was awesome because they they shot this movie. They made the way they you know the positioning of the camera made it look like the this bus was larger or you know more had more room, more space than it actually you know you know is. Now this so lady plot was exciting. As a matter of fact, when I started watching, I wasn't interested. I was like, which one is this one again now? 
You understand? But I loved the intrigue, the, the thrill, the suspense there. It's a suspenseful movie. It's a movie that will keep you wanting to know what next because you would want to understand where each of the actors, the players in this movie are coming from. And, you know, each stage in the plot kept unfolding to see you know to introduce that you know there is more than meets the eye with this guy with Sola Sobowale with Femi Jacobs you know there was more but you know with Nigerian movies and all of that you would always have something to complain about now what I particularly found annoying to an extent like I said was the fact that uh, towards the end of the movie you know, the way they were trying to resolve everything. And then, you know, what really made me love this movie, apart from the storyline, was when they took them to the bush. You know, it exposed the dangers, the actual dangers, like people are traveling and not everyone makes it in that journey. You know, sometimes people just lose their lives, you know, senselessly. Like, you would just begin to wonder, to marvel at... You know, the decisions people make for money, for, uh, I don't know, for whatever decisions that they make, you know, you, you, you begin to rationalize, like, why did you ever make this decision? You know, you will see the senseless killing of um, some of the actors and actresses. You will see the, you know, the method of survival. Everything was okay. Yes, it was okay if I may say so. I enjoyed watching Sole. Sole was 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 um, real for me. It was articulate. It was to the point. Um, I don't really have much to talk about it, but um, ah, they should have done this. They shouldn't have done that thing. But there were some places that were not real. But apart from that, it was an excellent watch for me. It, I, I never expected it to be that beautiful. It was wonderful. I'm going to be rating it a 9 over 10. So Lei really impressed me. They impressed me. Kayode Kashima, I'm always, I always have something like he did not do this, he did not do that, or he should have done this better, or he should have done that better. But in this one, Kayode Kashim really went, you know, beyond. And then the actors and the actresses, Meg Otanwa, the other movie she acted where I think she had postpartum depression. I didn't really, I wasn't really feeling her in that movie. But Meg Otanwa in this movie, in Sole, was awesome. Adni Ade, as always, is so beautiful to see. Sola Sobowale adds life, as usual. She brought it in. I was so shocked when she, you know, you know as the movie kept pro progressing, when she revealed who she really is. And, you know, it just... It, 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 the, the movie, apart from being a thriller, um, a suspense-filled movie, it's informative because you will just, you know, know that not everyone that you board um, a plane or anything is who you think they are. And so it was wonderful. I did not really understand the role of Femi Jacobs. That, that role, that part of the story was childish. And um, he would have stuck to just being um, a professor, a lecturer, and um, not bringing those other things because he kind of like trivialized it. But um, well, what other way to rescue the people than, you know, using Femi Jekylls? But all in all, it was wonderful. Um, it was excellent. I couldn't really understand how those... Um, police people posing as students, how they manage themselves. But all in all, <laughs> it must always be one snack somewhere. All in all, it was a good watch for me. And like I said, I will be rating it a 9 over 10. The sound was wonderful. The um, picture quality was awesome, perfect. Although it was a bit dark, some dark, especially when they were in the bush. I know, yes, it was shot in the night and all that, but the, I expected it to be less grainy, you know, less... Um, I don't know, but it wasn't sharp, you know. I needed more light, even though it's night, you know. But all in all, it was wonderful. They did great for once. Kayode Kashem 
he did awesome thank you so much for doing this up there you see my korean movie review my nigerian movie review my chinese movie review and then my movie reviews if you haven't subscribed don't forget to hit on the subscribe button don't forget to turn off your post notifications to be alerted when new videos come up i can't i can't believe i'm here okay so good to be back here thank you so much for doing this with me i'll see you next time bye bye